an MQ-9 Reaper is on a security patrol around Kandahar City, looking for insurgent activity. The ERS flies them to conduct intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance, or ISR missions, in the area. We take off once we're airborne. Our, our two primary things that we do is we set up the comm link between here and, and back in the U.S., and then we also check the laser. We have a, a bore sight board uh, here on the compound, and just like you sight in a rifle, uh, we sight in the crosshairs to make sure that whatever we're looking at, that's where the laser energy is going. The Reaper and other aircraft like it allows forces to observe while staying out of harm's way. Okay. We can do strategic ISR, looking for the, the big fish out there. We can do the tactical ISR, you know, watching, uh, either watching our forces. Uh, if they're on a mission, we can provide overwatch or just, you know, in the local area providing base defense. Whatever we can do where you need eyes in the sky. Some weapons were discovered uh, to get by using the RPA during today's operation. So far, the squadron's found two rockets. Uh, we blew up one of them ourselves with a Hellfire off an MQ-1, and we got some of the other forces around here to, to take out the other one. These unmanned planes will continue to operate and be used to help coalition forces to locate insurgents. Army Sergeant Robert Liddy, Kandahar Airfield, Afghanistan.